Hello guys, welcome back to Salesforce Anytime channel. Have you ever had a request uh, to onboard uh, like group of users or even like remove a group of users from uh, different public groups? Uh, if they have left your organization, probably you would want to remove few users from multiple public groups at a time, right? So if you had a, that kind of situation, the uh, in Salesforce how you do is you actually go to the each of the user and um, probably do the assignments for the public groups right in the public groups assignment section um, but what if you can do that um, for all the users on a single screen for example you have got request to uh, probably onboard like five users then you could just search for those five users and then you can um, do assign them the respective public groups on a single screen so let's look at that how you can do that so as you can see on the screen here uh, on the left hand side you would see the public groups um, so whatever public groups we have on the organization and on the right hand side you see the users what you have selected to give or remove access for so let's go to the um, pack magic so I'm already logged in and I can go to the group assigner so here uh, I have uh, for demo purpose I have a couple of users so I have John and I'm going to add him and let's uh, add Michael as well yep I got Michael as well so these are two test users so I'm going to view uh, which are the public groups they are already part of so as you can see I have only two public groups in my org so that's why I can see those two here so if you had multiple public groups you, you would see it all here uh, below them and you would see which uh, public groups they have been assigned uh, with the assigned checkbox here so as you can see John has been assigned to marketing experts group and um, Michael has been assigned to the sales experts group so what if I want to give um, John also the sales expert uh, public group right so on a single screen I can just go ahead and check this box and click on the save point button so once I click that it will take some time and once saved uh, so the processing icon has gone so that means it's saved if you want to verify the permissions uh, if it has been saved or not just go back and click on the view edit uh, group uh, button again so it is going to show you that it has been updated so this is what I wanted to show you uh, this is very helpful in case you want to view multiple um, users at a time so even if you wanted to remove access for example I want to remove access uh, for John from multiple public groups I can just deselect this box and I can just click on save pump button again so this is going to remove John from all of those public groups and if I see it again it should be removed yep so it has been removed so this is very powerful tool so you can use it as you want and that would help you um, do some of the user onboarding or offboarding activities uh, faster than how you can do it today so thank you very much for watching this video I hope you liked it uh, just leave your comments in the YouTube video 